Greetings travelers. This video contains spoilers for Act 1 and 3, but I'll try to reveal as little as possible. I'm going to show you how to deal with the hag in Act 1 and Act 3, as well as how to potentially maximize the rewards. Starting with short work on Act 1, our main purpose is to save Myrina. We can do this in two ways. Either kill the hag or intimidate the hag into leaving Myrina and giving you the reward, which is permanent plus one to start of your choice. Regardless of the decision, grab the wand controlling Myrina's zombified husband and meet her outside to send her off. Fast forward to Act 3, we need to first save Myrina from Hex spell. For clues, talk to her with spell or potion of animal speaking. Now you need to destroy the voodoo doll. I opted in for magic missiles, as even after position swap they tend to follow the target. As you damage the doll, Myrina will also take the damage, so you might want to keep someone close to her and heal her up. Once doll is down, Myrina will provide you with information and access to her safe, which will contain items for our next steps. Read the book from the safe, and they will provide you with Hag's Bane recipe. Press H to open alchemy menu and find Hugs Bane in grenade section. You will need Ashes of Dried Fey Flower, which you will already have from the safe, and any essence which you can craft yourself. Once you obtain Hugs Bane, keep it until we reach Hug Encounter. Follow the quest through until you end up in Blushing Mermaid Bar. In there, go to basement from either front bar doors or stairs in captain's room, then jump up on the ledge and walk into hidden passage. Once in there, you can either put the mask on, on one of your stealthy characters and pickpocket the guardians while they are non-aggressive for the key, or kill the guardians for the key, or sneak past everyone and lockpick the doors. I suggest sneaking past and opening the doors yourself as it's an easy roll. Once in, position two fighters close to the middle mushroom, also make sure one of them have Hugs Bane, and two characters that can quickly destroy the second mushroom close to either one of them. Destroy the first mushroom with your fighter and Hug will appear. Ideally you want to throw Hugs Bane at her before her round, as she will create clones which can confuse you into throwing potion at the wrong Hug. Once she's hit with a potion, cutscene should trigger where she will vomit up the girl. In case if it bugs out and the potion doesn't work, don't worry, there's a way around it. Continue the fight, keep in mind that Hug clones will only survive one damage from anything, and try to ignore her allies as they will turn friendly once you kill the Hug. Take Hug to low health and then finish her off with non-lethal attack, you can trigger this in passive section. Once you knock her out, you can perform a C-section and cut the child out. Once child is safe, finish off the mushrooms and kill the Hug. Once Hug is down, speak with Captain for peace of law then go to Laura and Vanra house for your reward which will be a very strong legendary rapier and epic necklace. Also visit Myrina to finish her questline and obtain another epic necklace. And this concludes the hug story in Baldur's Gate 3. See you next time.